What's going on guys? Ron Moore here. It's uh, Easter weekend. Uh, we just finished our family Easter uh, kind of little uh, uh, feast of sorts and uh, I just figure I blog now and you probably guys will get this on Monday. And uh, so first of all, I hope you guys enjoyed the long weekend. Happy Easter for those who celebrated. And um, for those who have been uh, feasting for the last few days, you know, through family gatherings, Got an idea for you to set you up on the right note, uh, because what I find is during events like Easter, you know, Christmas and uh, other holidays, uh, always a chance to overeat and there's always uh, a chance of slipping back to your old habits if you've been uh, on track. So let's dial uh, the nutrition in, let's get back on track and the tip of the day, uh, tip of the week actually, is just uh, just thinking about it in terms of my strategy, what I'm going to do this week, because this weekend I eat a lot more starches than I normally would. Uh, maybe reduce your starch intake uh, to four a week. That's what I'm going to do. So you might want to try that. So limit your starch intake to four for this week and uh, try to incorporate uh, different breakfasts. You can use my website as a great resource. Uh, try one of my shakes. I have two of them on my website. I'll, uh, I'll link you to those. Maybe uh, those, uh, one of them is an almond milkshake and the other one's a breakfast milkshake. And uh, other idea is uh, maybe even going with pancakes possibly. For breakfast but the idea is to lower your starch intake um, so think maybe for snacks you know if you are a snacker having fruit maybe some nuts uh, let's say during lunch maybe having some chili or you know having like something uh, something like a tuna salad without you know uh, the pasta in it if you put you know depending on how you make your tuna salad or if you're gonna have tuna you know without the bread um, or chili works really well as a lunch and uh, dinner, pretty easy, you know, especially now that the weather is nice. Put steak on the barbecue or some chicken, you know, put some asparagus, you know, maybe a side of legumes possibly, or, uh, you know, a salad. So that's about it. Just a nice tip to get you back on track because you probably feel full. Uh, I pigged out and uh, I don't feel guilty actually, and I don't think you guys should either. So uh, during times of celebrations with family and friends, it's, uh, it's important to indulge. But uh, it's important to get back on track uh, the following week. So that's about it. Wanted to sign off. Thank you for tuning in. And uh, if you haven't signed up for my newsletter, definitely uh, sign up for that to get more tips. And uh, really changing the website around for the spring and summer. I'm going to come at you with great exercises and uh, great videos uh, to keep you lean, fit, healthy. So make a decision and a commitment to getting in the best shape of your life and make it happen.